Damian Wayne is the son of Batman and carries the mantle of Robin, but this is the story of how he came from being Robin to become the vigilante Nightwing. Now, as we see in the Injustice 2 video game, Damian Wayne betrays Batman and joins Superman's side as part of the regime. That's enough. Let's go. But the inmates! Not today. This divides the two, a divide that is made worse when Damien kills Nightwing. For full details on how he kills Dick Grayson, see my other video on this, a uh, link to it is in this video's description. Now Damien didn't mean to kill Dick Grayson, but that doesn't matter to Batman. He is still partly responsible and that is something Batman cannot forgive. You're dead to me. Damien does of course have trouble dealing with this, but doesn't really have anyone to turn to, except maybe Alfred. And in one of their talks, Alfred advises Damien not to live in Batman's shadow, to try to be his own man. It is also mentioned that the Nightwing costume is missing from the Batcave. This is a reference to a previous story in the Injustice comics. Basically, Damien was having trouble dealing with his stepbrother dying and being partly responsible for this death, and he was also dealing with the fact that the regime was at war with his father. But during this, he stole the Nightwing costume, which shows that he had designs on wearing it later, or he may have just taken it as a memento of the deceased Dick Grayson. Later on, Damien, after having talked to Alfred, is stopping a burglary by Catwoman, and she offers him the same advice. Essentially, Damien basically says he's unhappy with who he is, and she says that he can just become someone else. Damien has a lot on his mind, and being the son of Batman, his way of blowing off steam is to attack a stronghold of supervillains alone, and attempt to take them all out himself. Now, after Dick Grayson died, he later became Dead Man. For full details, see my other video on this. Again, there is a link in the video's description. But Dick Grayson is now a ghost, and he likes to keep an eye on Damien. As they are stepbrothers, there is a bond there. Unlike Batman, Dick Grayson doesn't hold Damien responsible for his death, and bears him no ill will at all. And it's a good job that he does look in on him from time to time, because Damien is losing the fight against the supervillains. The problem is, he's just so outnumbered that there is no way he can win. Of course, he is very skilled, and he even manages to take a lot of them out but eventually he is overwhelmed and knocked unconscious, and if Dick Grayson hadn't intervened, then he would most likely be dead. Just as Bronze Tiger is knocking Damian Wayne out, Dick Grayson possesses Bronze Tiger. As Dead Man, he is able to possess people, and then as Bronze Tiger, Dick Grayson beats up all of the supervillains, calls for the regime to come and take them away, and then knocks himself out, and by himself I of course mean Bronze Tiger's body, which he then leaves. But Dick Grayson also leaves Damian Wayne a present. It's Damian Wayne's birthday, and the present has a note that reads, what are you waiting for, an invitation? And inside of the box is a Nightwing suit. Damien has been struggling with his grief, his identity and his place in the world, and decides to take Alfred and Catwoman's advice and reinvent himself as the new Nightwing. Though technically he is still in the shadow of Dick Grayson, so it could be said he's just switching from Batman's shadow to Dick Grayson's. But I think he's trying to honour the memory of Dick Grayson by taking his identity as Nightwing, and he's doing this over his guilt for his part in killing Dick Grayson. And that is how Damien Wayne became Nightwing. The comic does seem different to the game, in that the feeling I got from the game is that Damian Wayne deliberately murdered Dick Grayson, and then took his identity as a kind of trophy. His son. But Superman's been more of a father than you ever were. You stopped being my son when you killed Dick Grayson. He was my son. But the full story is that he didn't want to kill Dick Grayson at all, and that Dick Grayson actually wanted him to become Nightwing because he thinks it will help Damian Wayne deal with his identity issues. But what do you think? Do you agree that Damian Wayne is trying to honour the memory of Dick Grayson by being Nightwing? Or that he has another reason for taking the Nightwing mantle? Be sure to let us know in the comments, and I'd just like to give a quick thank you to those of you who made this video possible by donating to Needlemouse Productions' page on Patreon. Patreon is a crowdfunding site that's helping us to bring you more videos each week, and to raise funds to adapt comic book stories into animated short films. And as always, thanks for watching, and feel free to subscribe, share, like, and comment.